This is high school, not a daycare. Okay, I don't want to share a locker either, but we have to compromise. Okay, this is not meeting halfway. Holly J, great locker locale. Fab, hi. You look hot even in these disgusting hallways. <laughs> oh, we know each other, right? Uh, you probably remember her waddling from class to class. Or Mia. Jones, I, I was at Lakehurst. Yeah, yeah, you had a baby. That her? <laughs> Cute. <laughs> All right, see you guys later. That sad guy sure is hot. No, Manny, I call him. Don't worry, I don't go after 10th graders. So you gonna talk to him? It just seems soon after my last boyfriend. Mia, the past is the past. Carpe diem, seize the sav. Many have tried, none have succeeded, especially ones with baby weight. Now what would I do without Holly J. Sinclair looking out for me? Hold on, Holly J. Sinclair? As in Heather St. Clair? She's my sister. Wait, boyfriend stealing, bad nose job having, puppy drowning, queen of evil is your sister? Taught me everything she knows. <laughs> this might be a problem, sweetie. What? Why? Listen, I have to debate her tomorrow morning. Tell me everything. Let's just say if Holly J and Heather share the same DNA, you're gonna have to fight fire with huge, enormous flames. Out of light. When intelligent people look at both sides, a fight becomes a debate. Remember, passion is persuasive. Let's see it. Our topic is foreign adoption, with Holly J on affirmative and Mia on negative. Be it resolved that foreign adoption has many benefits. By illustrating these benefits, I intend to prove that orphan children in other countries receive far less care than orphan children here. That doesn't mean those children don't need a family just as much. <laughs> Point of personal privilege, Mr. Chairman. Just because I don't have a child... Point of inquiry, Mr. Chairman. Does the speaker realize that a spray tan is running? Sav. Uh, speaker is out of order. My worthy opponent is biased due to her matronly obligations and cankles. <laughs> well, then maybe we should debate testing for psychosis in herpes-infected teens, since the speaker is uh, highly qualified. Uh, order in the court. Mia, if you can't be mature about this, take a seat. But, Miss Kwan, I was... Next group. <laughs> Hey, do you have room for one more? Actually, I've got room for one and a half. <laughs> hey, Sav, about the debate. I was stupid. Okay. Holly J has got a knack for provocation. Trust me, I know. Oh, uh, why were you guys ever? Oh, no, no way. The only thing she and I have in common is Lakers. Mm. So, you're not, uh, you're not seeing anyone? Nah, free as a bird. Good morning. Mia, had a great time last night. Uh, so many coffees, I couldn't sleep. Listen, tell Isabella I said thanks, huh? Tell her yourself. We go to the park after school. Want to join us? Uh, sorry, I got soccer. Well, then maybe next time. <sighs> Mia, you're great, uh, but I don't, I don't want to jump into anything until I've got my bearings around here, okay? <laughs> yeah, of course. 
See you in class, okay? So, the search for stepdaddy continues, huh? That's sad. You're evicted, Holly J. <laughs> you can't evict me. I am? Looks like I just did. <laughs>